On December 10, 1815, in London, the family of the poet George Byron and his wife, Anne Isabella, expanded to become larger because of Burr's, a magnificent girl who was named Augusta Ada. And yeah, it was me. My father left England when I was one year old. Neither mother nor grandparents ever called me Augusta because this name was given to me by him. Mother decided to teach me mathematics and natural science. She was afraid of my temperament. I did not write poems as Lady Byron wished. I was attracted by machines. I was impressed by meeting with Charles Babbage, professor of mathematics at the University of Cambridge. Babbage had been developing a calculating machine for 10 years. Babbage asked me to translate notes with commentary and in 1843 commentary translation was published. The work came out under the acronym AAL since it was considered independent for a woman of high society to publish works under my own name. On July 19, I told Babbage that I had written a program on my own to calculate the Bernoulli numbers. Babbage had been developing a calculating machine for 10 years. This machine, now known as Babbage Bit Different Engine, contained the principles on which modern computers operate. Ada Lovelace was the first programmer in the history. When Ada Byron became 20, she was married to 29-year-old William King. Neither family worries nor others but hell did not stop her in studying mathematics. Ada Lovelace died, like her father, at the age of 36 on November 27, 1952. Cancer was the cause of death. We are grateful to her for making an invaluable contribution to science.